Good morning everyone. This is another session on palmistry and in this video we will be discussing few more points. Okay, and uh, first of all we would like to start uh, with the uh, you know the fish like symbol which is generally confused to be as the fish symbol. Okay, now this is actually not a fish symbol if you go by the general fish symbol. The general fish symbol is actually you know having a smaller face something like this and a longer you know longer the second half becomes kind of longer so it is something like this but this more looks to be like a diamond shape okay it can also be interpreted as a cross and followed by a square okay anyway it can be interpreted but you know in general this cannot be uh, told as a fish symbol now it can also indicate that uh, you know this symbol uh, at times i found that it indicates towards a person who can be spiritual it can also indicate towards a person who is uh, uh, obviously getting uh, is protected because it's it's more like a square so so the person is protected from any of the negatives of jupiter okay and uh, that is the ambitions that is the leadership and all these kind of things will get protected the person will not get humiliated for the same so this acts as a protector the square the square can also mean an interest in teaching as we already know that it's known as the teacher square and at times it can also indicate towards a person who is uh, good in giving instructions in general also this can be interpreted as a presence of a, cr a cross which also indicates towards an interest in teaching or an interest in giving uh, lectures and things like that now going ahead now uh, you know again i would like to clarify one more thing in this uh, in this video that the triangle whichever we talk about has to be an independent triangle okay if it is randomly formed something like the lines were just cutting across and you found a, a triangle now that will not have that much of an power or uh, meaning uh, a more uh, meaning would be relevant if the triangle is very independent okay if it is found in an independent fashion something like this and then it tends to have a uh, you know uh, a slightly or is slightly more meaningful now getting ahead also uh, uh, sometimes you will find a spiral like uh, you know fingerprint it will be like a spiral okay going ahead and and and, and, and something like a spiral it uh, generally indicates towards a uh, it's more like a world okay you can you can say it's a combination of world world is nothing but small concentric circles going uh, up like this and this in this spiral is slightly a modification of that so world indicates uh, towards a person who can be uh, a bit self-centered who can work alone well and that is also the reading given for a person having a uh, uh, having a spiral uh, a spiral fingerprint a person having a spiral fingerprint can mean it can mean that this person is uh, can work alone very uh, well and uh, can be given uh, you know a separate room and this person will work on very well so it's something like that it uh, it also can indicate towards a bit of an adamant nature towards a specific field so depending upon the location of this spiral the spiral can be found on jupiter let's say it's found on the mount of jupiter so it can mean that the person will be adamant about his leadership qualities the person will be adamant about uh, leading things and all these kind of things so just associate it with the mounts in which it is placed okay and the spiral generally indicates towards uh, you know a person who can be a bit um, who can work alone well now getting ahead now these are referred to as the influence line as we always know they indicate towards the presence of an influence in our life and uh, this is known as the lifeline so whenever you see lines cutting across like this from the influence line to the lifeline now they can be interpreted in two ways okay one is that uh, the general stress of the person because horizontal lines indicate towards stress so it can mean that the stress of the person okay whose hand is being looked into that stress is causing a problem to the influence as well as to the person himself or herself 
Now if that can be one case but if these lines starts emerging from the influence line you see from the influence line they are cutting across then that can mean that the influence is causing a stress on the person okay now uh, so it can also mean that the influence is causing some kind of a uh, disturbance okay but in any case because the stress line is if the stress line cuts both the lines it indicates some kind of stress both to the influence as well as to the person now obviously if you see uh, let's say these stress lines are present and then you see an, another influence line coming in and then this influence line continues and there are no more stress line that means some other influence came in okay because of which that this stress got released so some additional person some additional influence came into life and because of which this uh, you know the stress uh, lines kind of disappeared so that is another thing which i wanted to discuss uh, again see the star marking on the mount of moon i found it in few people who were very good in creative pursuits but always see that that the headline this is known as the headline never connects directly to the star the headline directly connecting to a star is not a very good marking now getting ahead also uh, see at times you will see a rising line okay this is the lifeline a rising line followed by a dropping line okay this can indicate you know uh, it's like a bird like symbol now it can indicate that obviously it's an effort line so at this age say around uh, 19 or so the person has put some kind of an effort and has done well and after that the lines which go outwards actually kind of indicates towards a travel so the person made an, a lot of effort and at the same time got an opportunity to travel something like that it can be interpreted you will see that whenever these outgoing lines are timed and uh, you know verified in the palm in most of the cases it does indicate towards a fruitful travel so hopefully you got few more points in this video I'm Shwetank into palmistry. Do check my channel for more. Thank you. Take care. Have a great day. Bye-bye.